So you've stitched this beautiful piece of PC, and now you want to add some kind of an edging to cover this raw edge. Okay, we're going to do a little whip stitching, and I like to start that in the center of one side of my project. Bring the needle up through the canvas toward you, and then leave a little tail about an inch or so, and hold that right against the edge of the canvas like you see here. Whip stitch is nothing more than this, bringing the needle up through the hole in the edge of the canvas toward you. And that causes this yarn to wrap around the edge, as you see here, and make a nice little finish. So you do this, bringing the needle up, in each hole in the edge of the canvas. And stitch toward the direction where you lay that original piece of leading yarn. Right, so as I'm stitching along here, I'm also covering up that leading edge, and now it'll be invisible as I continue stitching. Now when you get to a corner, you're going to need an extra stitch to cover that distance. So what I do is in the same corner hole, I stitch once, twice, and three times. That gives you plenty of coverage, as you can see, and then you just move on and keep stitching. Now when you get to the end of a strand of thread, here's how you end it. On the back of the canvas, locate some reasonably long stitches that are near where you stopped whip stitching. Pass your needle underneath a few of those, and then pull the edging yarn through and go ahead and cut it. And that is all there is to whip stitching. And look! at what a nice finished edge that creates for your plastic canvas.